Tonight, I want you to see what neighborhoods like this one in Pasco County are dealing with. They are flooded and people are having to use canoes and kayaks instead of cars. You're watching 10 Tampa Bay at 5. I'm Courtney Robinson. And I'm Dave Wagner. Water already closing in on houses and concerns are growing over rising river levels while thousands remain in the dark this evening. Right now, Duke Energy has about 5,000 customers in Pinellas County still without power. The company says the light should be back on for everyone by tomorrow night. Meanwhile, Tico has more than 162,000 customers without power. The company says it should be able to get those lights back on to everyone by Thursday. Right now, nearly 70% of Tico customers have gotten their power back. In Citrus County, river levels are also rising. The Sheriff's Office says the Withlacoochee River could reach levels higher than what was seen during Hurricane Irma in 2017. 10 Tampa Bay Chief Meteorologist Bobby Deskins joins us right now. Bobby, some of the rivers will crest this week. Yeah, that's right. Some of the rivers have actually already crested too. In fact, most of them have, and that's the really good news. But others like the Withlacoochee, the Peace River, the Peace River will go up probably another six inches or so. That's in the Bartow area in Polk County. This is the Withlacoochee at Croom. This is the northern end, say just the eastern part of Hernando County. We have Croom, and then we have Trilby on the south end there. But Croom will still go up to about 13 feet. It's at 11 feet now. It's going to go up another two feet. This is today, tomorrow. It looks like now by Thursday before it crests. Wednesday, Thursday time frame it may change a little bit. But what you need to know is it's coming up another foot at least between now and another two feet, I should say, between now and then. Now the rest of the rivers, for the most part, have started to come down. They have crested. That includes Cypress Creek. That includes the Hillsborough River, uh, Anclo River, which the horrible flooding there, right? Uh, record flooding, basically. And then you can see Alafaya. Yeah, all of those are coming down. The other one that I talked about, the Withlacoochee, the south side of Hernando County, uh, that one at Trilby is still coming up and will come up. I think it stays below the record of 20 but it looks like it's going to get close to 19 feet, so maybe another half a foot or so as it comes up. Now, the good news is that most are falling and the forecast does not have much rain. In fact, drier air is moving in, which will help some of it to evaporate, it's just a little bit, uh, but also some cooler air. We're gonna have some really comfortable air for all of the cleanup, not just in the rivers here, but also on the beaches, the wind everywhere that's all the damage. We're gonna have some really nice weather coming up and I'll talk about that in my full forecast.